magic of our friends in La Policia is to tell the conjured up. Nothing. They couldn't get anything off the car. It was burned to the bone. Of course it was. Burned to the bone? When they arrived, the fire just started. Policia said that when they got to the scene, Adelita was just standing there. The other car was too far to pursue. <laughs> Must have been someone who was spooked by the sirens. Hmm. Sure. And Adelita didn't even try to escape. Makes perfect sense, right, Porter? You know what they say about drastic confusion. No, I don't. What do they say? You should have your plebes pack all this up. Apparently nothing at all. <laughs> Ahoy, matey. <laughs> She's just shaking her head. Like every other character who has ever met Porto. I need more money. Emily, please help me. And then I can help you too. Eso, vamos. No sé, voy a checar con Néstor. Fuck out here. Who the fuck is that? And why did they just wait here? Who the fuck are you guys? How did they know about this? Where to find Alvarez? It's Coco and Gilly. Gilly's with the Chinese. Coco's with his kid. Bailing Liddy out. <laughs> That's something to do with our school. She'll be back soon. Come on, brother. She'll be back soon? She hasn't even been part of the season yet, right? Looks like Chinagra has the best offer. Even their tax credits were lower. They were the last offer in. They came in right under the wire. There is no fucking way Chinagra came in with a lower tax credit. Oh, that guy taught them, huh? The guy who made the pictures? Who has access to the bids? Those bids are locked in my office until the deadline. Fuck, so your assistant, Marlin, he'd have access. He wouldn't do that. Why not? You did. Fuck you. <laughs> I should have never taken your filthy money. But you did! And now you owe me. So you're gonna tell me what I need to know. Oh, this storyline sucks ass. Marlon, he's the only one who had access to all the bids. And if I can prove that he helped China grant, that bid is disqualified. Yes? I guess. Are you going to prove that? You would need his confession, I suppose. What are you gonna do to him? Talk to him? Whatever it takes. Here's some more filth. <clears throat> Unbearable, that woman. How the fuck did they time this so perfectly and how did they even catch up? Why is your blood blank? <laughs> El Padrino's in trouble. What happened? We'll fill you in. Nobody's asking questions? They just picked up the rest of my parole shit from Stockton. You know me. Always your helper. Mm. Sounds like bullshit. Take off your mask. Fucking pussy. <laughs> I think it's the devil we know. Potter? And Hobart. The attack on his mercs. Yes. But he got out of Lita. Not confused him more. <laughs> I mean, it was so fucking obvious that staying wouldn't do anything. That it would just raise questions. We need to talk. This is not a place where we talk. I'm sorry, but I need you to... I don't care what you need. I'm in the middle of something. Yeah, so am I. Go home. 
Thank God for Miguel, the only one who puts her in her place. The signs on the truck. One of them slid up when it slammed into me. Caught the end of a phone number underneath. Two, four, three. Put Riz on it. That he even had to write down three numbers on his hood earlier to remember it. <laughs> it's three numbers. <laughs> I'll give you a couple of numbers you text. They'll call you back. I can go. He won't give up his club. Or former club. Potter left this morning, so if there was anything going on... What? what? You'd know about it? Come on, AJ. You're smarter than that. And the shit your boss does. Come on, AJ? These two know each other? I'll let him know you stopped by. Like the pretty little assistant you are. Fuck you. Yes, you have. Huh? For the Molino twins, call Burner. Need you to meet me. Molino means windmill in Spanish. Twin windmills. Turbines. Fucking farmland. See what farms are running with wind. Checking against the numbers. What? How does Everest even know where he is? I assume they didn't take off his hood until they brought him inside. Or wrap you so they didn't take home. Thank you for meeting me. Sure. What's this now? What does she need from Easy? Oh no, I'm okay. It's out. You're always shivering. Oh, you fucking white knight. Piss off, dude. <laughs> I know I have no right to ask you this. Ask me what? I need your help, Easy. No, oh, fuck off. So tired of this shit. Why didn't she go to her husband? After he was done with the Mayans. There's a bidding process that we should have won. But our Chinese competitor, they bribed a clerk in city planning. They got inside information. Actually, you don't even, you don't even know that this guy's involved. Not for sure. I can't tell Miguel. I just need to keep the other world out of this. What world am I in? <laughs> Hopefully mine. Oh, I can't stand her anymore. Just give him a chance to tell the truth. No charges. He walks away. But if he doesn't? He's got to. Oh, he got to! <laughs> He's not gonna risk going to jail. You don't even know what connections that guy has. Or what the other side is willing to do. So fucking painful. She doesn't know shit. It has to be done by tomorrow night. There's your reward, you, you white knight, you. <laughs> Jerk off to that after you're done with this job. Good thing you don't ride anymore, Hefe. <laughs> Brothers have ten more minutes to respond. If not, I spike the other hand and then I chop them the fuck off. He'll be fine, because I'm just. Not willing to accept that they kill off Alvarez in this fucking show after what he's been through and sounds. Can't see shit. Gonna have to get closer. Got this. All right, let's all stand up. <laughs> so they can see us. The three of us moving together kind of defeats the whole stealth thing. I'm not suicidal, you fucking morons. Just let me do something right. What exactly is stealth about this? Wow. Why the fuck is Happy here? Why is his son involved in all this shit? Kidding me? Seriously, that doesn't seem right at all. You can't just do another club's work without telling your own club. I mean, theoretically, this entire cartel and potter bullshit could come back to bite the sons in the ass. Just because Happy was involved. Give me a minute. Yeah? Just clean shit up. 
between us. This is cleaned up when we find out who did it. Yeah. Wait. Happy and the Prospect came here with a club van? Not on their bikes? I'm sure that's not possible either, that they can just hijack that van. And nobody asks any questions. And why did he even bring the Prospect? None of this makes any fucking sense. What did you need today? Um, it was silly. I ended up making one call. It was handled. <laughs> nothing to worry about. Yeah, sure, don't tell him. Even though it directly involves him, since this project is his too. It's the same shit like in Sans. People just keeping secrets for no good reason. Get out. <laughs> And they were such pros. Easy, Reyes. Oh, Valley pitcher? Marlon Buxer. I, I was a few years behind you. Played freshman ball. Oh, right. Right. What, you don't remember him? You never see him? <laughs> I just wanted to talk to you. About the agricultural park project. New car, new condo. That didn't happen on a clerk's paycheck. <laughs> he worked really hard, dude. Tell your boss the truth. Throw out the bid, it all stays internal. No one has to know. Fuck. The next best bid. Galindo and Lee Thomas. It's Emily Galindo, right? Or did she keep her name? Dude, she is a cartel whore now. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? <laughs> Once you get out of my house, trust me, this isn't gonna go your way. Even a guy living in his mom's basement is smart enough to know that. <laughs> I live in the attic. Okay. You can't trust this guy. He's going to attack you. Shit. There you go. <laughs> Maybe get out of here? <laughs> 